cool. Yeah. We are going to Death Valley. We are leaving tomorrow. So yeah, I really have to pack today. Then I don't know what's going to happen. It will be fun. This will be my first time. So I need to get my stuff together for that. And the thing is the motorcycle is super packed right now. I just have to get my stuff together. Definitely chapstick. I stopped using chapstick for a little while because everyone says that it dries out your lips more. So I was like, oh, okay, break the vicious cycle. I'm just not going to buy chapstick anymore. So I tried that and it's not better. So I just had super chapped lips for a while. So I Googled what to do, like what to use instead of chapstick. And it said to just use like your face moisturizer on your lips. I tried that. Let me tell you, not a life hack. It tastes pretty gross because you're going to get it in your mouth. So that does not work. So I'm back to just really old school EOS lip ball. I don't know, right now it's feeling like a game changer. So, Let's get going. I'll show you really quickly what I'm packing. These are my day clothes. I've got some sunglasses, just some basic aviators. I've just got some little like super old prana shorts that are like this outdoorsy material that's super easy to fold. Then this cute little top. It's kind of a crop top. I might show you this outfit. This is my motorcycle campsite outfit. I don't know what the material is. It feels kind of like, like a burlap bag. Moving on for toiletries. I'm just bringing like a super gentle cleanser, a moisturizer, sunscreen, and a lip balm. You could pack a little bit of makeup too. When I first started riding, that's something that I would do. But over time, I just kind of let that go because it just doesn't even feel comfortable wearing makeup underneath a moto helmet all day. And then the last clothes I'm bringing are just sleeping clothes. We're going to be sleeping in a tent, so I kind of want everything to be covered. So it's literally just like a long sleeve t-shirt and long black leggings. So once you have all your stuff picked out, obviously you're not going to just stick it on your bike like just floating around in your carrier bags or whatever your side bags. You probably want to get some dry bags. Cool. Okay. So these are dry bags, they come in different sizes. You can get them basically at any outdoor store like REI or if you have a local outdoor kind of sporting store. Whatever space you didn't fill, you basically just roll the bag down and then clip it together like that. The other thing that's super important to bring and to pack for moto travel is extra shoes that aren't your motorcycle boots. Because especially for camping, you're not going to want to get to your campsite and just be walking around in like semi motocross style, heavy duty boots all day. It's not comfortable. You need something else in case you want to go hiking or you just want something comfy to walk around in at your campsite. You've got everything in there. Then you just kind of squeeze this top bit together, roll it up, roll it down. Uh, you might have to stop and get all of the air out of there. Clasp it shut. And you're good. So that's it. That's what I'm packing. I don't know what's going on with my sleeves right now. That's all my moto trip stuff for Death Valley this weekend. I'm looking forward to this trip. I think it's going to be a ton of fun. I hope this video helped and I'll see you next time. Um, if you want to, then go ahead and subscribe to this video like it if you like it you don't have to i'm pretty new here so i would appreciate it